Hey guys, welcome to the fifth tutorial already. Uh, today I will show you how to use a loft. So we're gonna open a part again. Uh, we go to the top plane and we are gonna sketch on the top plane. Let's sketch a circle first and with a loft you can create really organic shapes so that's what we're gonna do we're gonna create just a weird looking shape and I will explain how to construct it so <coughs> um, we are gonna create multiple planes um, because we need a lot of different profiles and guide curves to construct a loft, a loft. so um, we will exit this sketch and then we will go to plane um, and we will select the top plane as our reference then in this box you can select the number of planes you want so between the planes there is a distance of 50 millimeters and I want to have more planes so you can increase the number of planes let's make another plane and then we are just gonna click click on this plane and we're gonna sketch on this plane we're just gonna create some some organic shapes like like a ellipse for example it doesn't matter how it looks like I just want to show how to use the loft uh, we will go to the plane above it sketch on it we can insert another ellipse starting from the origin exit sketch go to plane above it again be a smaller but wider ellipse Exit sketch, plane above it, doesn't really matter how it looks like, it's just for practice, to show you what you can do with the loss, and the last plane do this okay now we're done with the profiles and we are gonna sketch the guidelines let's use the front plane click on sketch normal 2 and we will use a spline And connect everything together what's important now is that you uh, click on the vertex uh, hold shift click on the ellipse and add a relation and this relation will be a pierced relation uh, to make sure it's, it's really connected 
we're gonna do with this points we're gonna do the same add a pierce relation so on and you're sure that the guide curve and the profile is connected with each other <coughs> exit this sketch and then we're gonna do the other sides so go to front plane sketch spline connect everything together again okay and after this tutorial I have taught you I've learned you a lot of the basics so if you don't know anymore you should look at one of the videos again or if you have a question you can always send me a message okay we are done now with the guide curves we're gonna leave the sketch and right now we are gonna make a loft and that's right here at the fe features lofted boss base okay um, first select the profiles this one all together and sometimes to line up this these green balls it helps okay. right now we have a really organic shape and we have our guide curves here's one and right here's one and then when you click OK, then we have our lofts. And of course you can hide all the planes to see what it looks like. And the same you can do with um, with the, the loft cut. It's it's the same like a swept cut or a, a revolved cut. So you cut a 